Hey everyone, thanks for joining me today as we enjoy this amazing hobby together. Today we're going to be opening up 8 packs of 2021 Tops and Gypsy Queen. I know this is something different, something new for the channel, um, but I found these at, um, at Target and I was like, you know what, let's give them a try. What's the worst that could happen? Right, And so if you're new to my channel, I just wanted to let you know that I like to rip up my product slowly. All right, I like to enjoy my, I like to enjoy myself. I like to take my time because this hobby is expensive and it is hard to find retail product at retail prices right now in this hobby. So that's why I like to take my time. Um, if you don't have time for that, no worries. Feel free to jump to the end of the video where I'm going to do a recap. So let's get ripping and let's open up these eight packs of 2021 Tops and Gypsy Queen. All right. So, um, yeah, I mean, I don't I don't know if we're going to be hitting autos or not. I mean, it says packs with a special insert may contain only 23, two to three cards. Oh, right, that's fine. Um... So here's some of the information. If you're interested, I'll go ahead and uh, be free to pause it if you want. So, Gypsy Queen. You know, I like Gypsy Queen. It's not horrible. Um, do I like it more than Heritage? I don't know. For me personally, I, I guess it just depends on what you're looking for. But me personally, I kind of like Heritage a little more than Gypsy Queen. Um... I do think the design work in Gypsy Queen is pretty amazing. Um, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about here. Oh my gosh, this pack's so hard to open. All right, so we get six cards per pack here. Let's see what we got here. First pack is no color, but we got a Yasmani Grandal, Mr. Mike Clevenger, Zach McKinstry. Right? Is that how you say it? Robinson Cano? Zach McKinstry. Yep. One of the funny things about Gypsy Queen is that it only they only initialize the first name. So, like, for some of these players, I'm, like, guessing. I'm, like, Zach? Is that, what I'm, is that right? Yeah, it is. Robinson Cano. Colomb. Colomb. Oh, Franklin Colomb. Picture for the, um, for the Mets here. And another... Another White Sox player, a Moncada here. All right, so that was a decent pack. I think these packs are like three bucks each. I, I'm not too sure. Um, I forget. It's been a while since I bought. Um, I don't remember when I bought these, but it's probably been at least like a month since I bought these. Um, like I said, I found these at a Target. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to grab them. All right, here we got Carlos Correa. Um, Kikuchi, what's his name? You say Kikuchi. Zach Plesak. Mr. Brandon Crawford. Um, Paredes. E Isaac Paredes. And, ooh, look at that. Kirilov here. That's sweet. I'm going to sleep up. It's Kirilov. And we got it. What is this? It's like a filler card. Yeah, just a security tab card. Special insert right there. But we got this Kirilov, which is pretty nice. Hopefully he can um, stay healthy and contribute to the Twins here. Not too bad. I like Kirilov. Um, all right, so pack number three here. And I'll uh, kind of talk about why I like Gypsy Queen, what I like about Gypsy Queen. Oops, sorry about that. So what I like about Gypsy Queen is just all this crazy, like intricate um, work, design, <laughs> work, design in the card. It looks like a dollar bill. It just looks really cool. Um, Hyun, Hyun Jin Ru, all right, and Louise Robert for the Robert PC. And we got Heim, Jonah Heim, Jonah Heim for the Rangers. Yep. Uh, Elo Jimenez, we're getting lots of White Sox here. Sergio Romero, Seth Romero. I'm thinking Sergio, another Sergio Romero, Sergio 
Rome, Romeo, I forget his name, Michael Chavis. You know, we're getting some, we're getting rookies. We're getting like a couple rookies per pack. And so, yeah, like I said, I think these were like three bucks each. And this was a few months ago. And so, I was just happy to see anything. Um, this is when Target was showing like, um, they, they had like, like score football, Gypsy Queen baseball, and it, it was like the first time in like months since I've seen sports cards, um, baseball, the, the three major sports in Target. So I was just so excited. I grabbed up, I grabbed as many as I could. Clark Schmidt rookie card, the Garcia, Jose Garcia. All right, and we got Christian Javier. Who was he throwing? That's just like a split change or something, man. Right? That just might be a split that he throws. Uh, Eddie Rosario, who's just doing really well for the... Oh, my. Uh, he's doing really well for the Braves. And, oh, my. Could Brian Hayes. Wow. Dude, that card looks nice. Followed by David Bodie. And another one of those special inserts. We're getting some nice rookies. These are two... Two very good, two top rookies here. Quite excited about that. Brian Hayes and uh, Kirilov here. We're like halfway done as well. And so I'm, I'm not complaining. This is pretty sweet. Um, I'm sorry, my camera's going, oh. I'm trying to autofocus here. All right. So first card. Pack five, I believe. Yeah, pack five. Uh, Dubon, Mar Mauricio Dubon, very nice. Didi Gregorius, Willie Castro, right? Um, Espino, 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 Santiago Espino, very nice. Oviedo, Oviedo, who oh, Johan Oviedo, that's a good name. And Jorge Soler, who's also. Um, doing really well for the Braves. Good for him. Yeah, I'm really impressed how the Braves were able to assemble this outfield. And, you know, I remember at the trade deadline, everyone was like, yeah, you know, the Braves, are, they did pretty good. They did okay. You know, they would kind of rebuild their outfield a little bit, you know. Um, but, you know, they, they weren't the best. You know, we, we can't give them the best team, the team that did the best at the trade deadline, you know. But here they are. Here they are, Adam Duvall in center field. And I think left field and right field are just kind of platooning players. But it's working, man. It is absolutely working for them. Garrett Crochet, Ryan Braun, who's retired. Espinal Florio, right? Es Esteban Florio, Esteban. Yadier Molina, Jake, Jack Flaherty. Just guessing there. Calhoun, Calhoun. Cole Calhoun, that's right. It's fun. That might be one of my favorite things with Gypsy Queen. It's just trying to guess the person's first name. Um, so, but yeah, um, let me see. It is, I am recording this Monday night. So, game six is tomorrow night. And I'm hoping, I am hoping that the Braves win it Tuesday night. That would just be awesome. Uh, Ryan Castellani, right? Yep. Shugo Akiyama. Shogo. Shogo Akiyama. Shane Bieber. Ooh, a Ted Williams. That's cool. I haven't seen that card. Is that like a special insert? I don't know. Let me see. What's, what's these cards here? 3759. And then we got Suarez and Luis Arise. So let me just look at the back of these cards here. 3726. 3726. 3758. Yeah, so this Ted Williams might be a like a short print of some some kind. Not too bad. So I'll just leave it up. Short prints are always awesome. These older guys are awesome. Kind of makes me feel like I'm collecting vintage. <laughs> Even though I'm not, I'm just checking out the corners here because I think it's 
pretty banged up, but that's okay. Yeah, only four players have won two league, the two league triple crown. Hornsby and Gehrig. Yeah, Ted Williams. Man, I heard I remember, I was I was just reading that Roger Hornsby was averaging like two hundred hits um a a year during his career, which is just mind blowing. Just absolutely mind blowing. Yeah. All right. So last pack here. Let's see what we get with this gypsy queen here. Okay. Here we go. Give us one more good rookie here. Well, looks like we got an insert, maybe. All right. We got Alex Bregman, Edwin Diaz. Um. Choi, what's your first name? G-Man Choi. How could I forget that? Brian Harp, Bryce Harper. Oh, <gasps> hey, what, dude, dude, that is, that is nice. An on-card auto for Mercedes. Here we got uh, Aaron Nola in the back. Holy cow. Yerman Mercedes. Holy freaking cow. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. That corner is a little soft. It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell with the camera here. Yeah. I know this corner looked a little soft as well. As well as this one. But... Wow. Wow. Can't believe it. You're in Mercedes. Um, yeah, this was the guy who was like destroying it at the beginning of the year. And then he got sent down to the minor leagues. And he was like, I quit. You know, took me took me forever to get to the majors. And... Like, I just don't want to make that climb again. And then I think then, like, the next day he's like, yeah, I'm back. Um, but I, I don't think he came back. He might get traded. Who knows? Who knows? But, I mean, dude, that's nice. You're in Mercedes. I was not expecting to get a rookie. Holy freaking cow. Just yesterday, I opened up an auto. It was um, Casey Mize, Casey Mize Auto. And then today, I open up a Yerman Mercedes Auto. Dude, that's so awesome. That's just so cool. Dude, man, I'm, I'm a little speechless, guys. Holy cow. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. Like a lot of the um autos I've pulled are not that impressive. And then, you know, yesterday I pulled that Casey Mize auto. Um and this and then today I pulled your main Mercedes auto. You know, I just realized I spoiled my tops opening day blaster box videos here, guys. Yeah, so I Oh, I filmed um, uh, Tops opening day uh, blaster yesterday, and I'm and I, I'm actually gonna review that one after I open up these. And so, yeah, sorry, totally just uh, uh, spoiled it for you guys. But still, dude, that's awesome. Like I can't complain. You got two good rookies, with Karloff and uh, Brian Hayes. Got a short print there. And I got a freaking uh, Mercedes on-card auto. Holy cow. Um, hopefully he comes back and does really well this upcoming year. Um, yeah, I'm, I'll be rooting for him for sure. Um, and so, yeah, guys. Yeah, I was like opening it. Remember, I opened up like those first few packs. And I was like kind of not complaining. But I was just kind of like making the observation. That, like I got a bunch of. Like these are like it's like all White Sox packs here, and then I open up that Luis Robert too, and then boom, 
I get a your Men Mercedes autograph card. That's pretty awesome. I'm excited about that. I like that. So, um, Gypsy Queen, Gypsy Queen. I give, you know, Gyp <laughs> with that auto, Gypsy Queen is growing on me a little bit. Um, do I like it more than Heritage? Now I gotta say it's on par with Heritage. I I still like Allen and Ginter the most out of these kind of more vintagey design sets that Tops makes. Um, but I mean, this yeah. So I I give it like a C C minus. Um, as a set, um, these packs, yeah, dude, an A, absolute A. I mean, I got, I got an auto. Like so, so like these eight packs, I give these an A, you know. Um, so got that short print as well. So not too bad for like eight packs, you know. Paid like twenty five bucks, right? Eight times three is like twenty four bucks. So, like that's a great deal for these cards. So, yeah. Um, hey, thank you so much for watching this video to the end. Um, I really appreciate it because you know I know your time and your attention is really valuable to you and so if you could give this video a like all right i mean shoot we got a short print and we got an auto that deserves a like right and if you enjoy my video um you know feel free to subscribe and to um, click that notification bell as well and so that you know when i upload more videos right now i'm uploading about five videos a week um that might change in the future we'll see how how this hobby goes and um and uh, how much time i've got available uh i've got Work is going to start picking up soon for me, so I might cut it down to four, just to let you guys know. Oh, and, hey, I've got 26 subscribers now, so, like, subscribe to the video because I'm going to be giving away, uh, this upcoming Monday, I'm going to be giving away um, a Prism Cello Pack. So, subscribe, and all you got to do is subscribe is subscribe. If you're subscribed, I'm going to pick a random subscriber and I'm going to send you this cello pack of 2020-21 Prism Basketball. All right? So subscribe. And um, so, yeah, uh, I hope you guys are having a lot of fun in the hobby. Remember, it's an amazing hobby. And I hope you guys are able to secure some product at some really good prices and that you guys are getting some amazing polls like that. All right? So, you take care of yourself, and I'll see you in the next video.